Hey YouTube, this is BJ Ray 20. What you see here are two layers across on top of the roof of my 2007 Chevy Tahoe LTZ. Um, two layers of the Sundown Audio Sound Deadener. This is 160 mil. Probably really can't see the thickness. But if you see, it has this little groove right here. Um, this is an asphalt base. It's really hard. This is just up there right now. I have this metal roller. And as you see, it's about as good as it's going to get on there. And it still leaves little gaps. That's why it's good to put heat to it. I've seen a video when someone, um, he still got good results, he said. But all he did was apply the detonator on top without putting heat to it. This is an asphalt base, so it requires heat. Some people use heat guns. I'm using a torch. And I already put two layers up here in the front. As you can see, torched it, rolled it on there, got in between the seams. That's just one layer so far. Once I fill this gap in, I'm gonna go back in it again. But the, if you look at the back side, that's in between the gap, kind of sm smeared it in. But there's no, nothing like this where you can see a little gap. I'll grab my blade. Let's see if I can show you my blade. As you can see, and the denner is just up there. Leaves a little gap. Compared to this side, blade is not getting in there at all. So it's not completely sealed when you just put it up here like this. Um, like I said, I'm gonna show you guys a little demonstration. Put the Get real hot. Bake this dander on here. see the smoke As you can see, pretty much raised up, bubbled up, but it's all good. Let's go ahead and, as you see, as you roll, it drops right in that seam. That's, and that's what you want. You want it to drop in that seam so it can, it can get every last bit. And it doesn't matter if it. This right here is like a little tear, but it doesn't matter because, like I said, it's like an asphalt base. You can just roll that in and just eventually get it where getting it real good. Like I said, just keep. Doing it, keep working it. It's pretty tedious, but I really like it. 
because um, after it hard, cools down, it's like forging metal or something. It's like actually taking another piece of metal onto the, the factory metal and just keep stacking it and stacking it, making it stronger and stronger. If, uh, if I had to kind of break it down. So yeah, just keep keep rolling it on and rolling it on and eventually seam that you see right there with the two sheets eventually it's gonna look just like this it's gonna join together cool thing is any little tiny pieces that you might have that's broken off doesn't really matter I can sit this right here on top heat it up and smear it right in and as you can see that spot that lifted up that was a little tear it's now pretty much worked in there you know and when it hardens up it just joins like one and as you can see without the heat it leaves that little gap like I said with my blade I'm gonna try this again show you guys my blade did you see the blade goes through This side, it's not getting in there at all. You gotta put the heat to it. That's about it. Just uh, showing you guys what's going on. It fits two layers across. Gotta put some good heat to it. I mean, if you use a heat gun, you know, to each his own. I have a heat gun, but when I watched uh, the Sundown Audio official YouTube channel, he said it needs to be baked on, use a torch, and that's exactly what I'm doing, you know. Picked this up from Walmart, got some refill cans, just in case this one goes out. Got a backup one right here. So far, so good. I'm going to finish this one up. Um, I have to go to work tonight, so I'm going to get as much as I can done before I... You know, rest up for work. But for the most part, it's a little little time consuming and you gotta really work it in compared to traditional um sound deadners where you just roll it on and kinda set it and forget it. This one you have to put high heat to it and really work it in. So like I said, it's a it's it's a it's a real job. <laughs> you know, to get my words straight. It's a real task. But uh, well worth it in the end. So, sorry to keep you guys on so long. As always, peace and love. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more.